Hi everyone, it's Merc007 here. Thank you for joining my board game video. Today I'd like to introduce you to Fantasy Tavern Brawl, a game designed in Japan that is getting an international release. Please enjoy! Fantasy Tavern Brawl is a fun fantasy 2-5 player fast-paced dexterity game designed by Adrao and published by Amudi Studio, an indie studio in Japan. Fantasy Tavern Brawl is coming soon to Kickstarter. This video is based on a prototype that was given, so some of the components here are prototype components. The game will come with English rules and likely other language rules as well. Visit the Rangbunctious Fantasy Tavern where orcs, elves, halflings and other patrons gather. In the midst of the brawl, use your fantasy race abilities to attempt to fling, drop, place and keep your bar patrons, the meeples, inside the tavern. Patrons that are still in the tavern at the end of the brawl score based on what floor they are on. Patron meeples on the ground floor score one point, meeples on the second floor score two points and so on. Setup. Each player chooses one colour and takes all the meeples in that colour. Those are the patrons that you want to keep inside the tavern. Place the starting tavern card in the middle of the table. Decide which scenario to play and then give each player the cards written in the scenarios. For example, in scenario 1, each player is given two dwarf cards, two orc cards and two halfling cards. and each player places one of their meeples on the tavern floor. Randomly select the starting player to go first and play goes clockwise. On a player's turn, they select one of their cards to play. To add that card to the table, they need to perform the actions listed on the card in order to try to add more of their patrons on the board or manipulate the tavern setting to their advantage. Cards that touch the tavern become part of the tavern, and the tavern floor will grow. The tavern floors can also expand upwards depending on how the cards are placed. Let's go over the seven fantasy races and see how they are played. Dwarves. To play the dwarf ability card, Place four patrons in the tavern, then place a card on top of them to indicate a new floor. For halflings, place the halfling card touching another card. Then flick four meeples to try to land them in the tavern. When playing elves, place the elf card touching another card. Then flick three of your elf patrons to try to land them in the tavern. To play the goblins card, slide the card towards the tavern. If it touches another card, then you can place three meeples on the current card and also move one meeple from anywhere in the tavern to somewhere else. When playing Orcs, fling the Orc card onto the table. If it touches another card to form part of the tavern, place two meeples in the tavern and remove two meeples. When playing the Minotaurs, fling the Minotaur card onto the table. If it touches another card to form part of the tavern, place one meeple and move three meeples from one place to another place. To play demons, drop the demon card onto the table. 
If it touches another card to form part of the tavern, place one meeple and remove one meeple touching the underside of that card. And any meeples that are removed as part of an ability is returned back to the owner. If you dropped, slid or flung a card and it doesn't become part of the tavern floor, it's removed from the game. After the player's finished performing the actions on the card, it's the next player's turn going clockwise. Once all players have played all the cards, the game ends. Each player counts up and scores the meeples that are inside the tavern. The patrons score depending on the floor they are on. If they are on the first floor, the ground floor, the patrons score one point each. The patrons that are on the second floor score two points each. The patrons on the third floor score three points each and so on. The player with the highest score is the winner. Fantasy Tavern Brawl is such a fun dexterity game that I really enjoy. It gives you that feel of visiting a role-playing tavern just when the brawl begins. The characters are nicely themed and I can imagine the dwarves gathering together to try to build the tavern. And all the patrons using their special abilities, magic and so on, causing havoc inside the tavern throwing things around and rearranging the room. I love dexterity games and have a few in my collection, but I especially love role-playing fantasy themed board games. Since I don't have much time to play long campaigns anymore, games like this that get my imagination going are very welcome. Since this one comes in a nice size portable box, this is a game I can definitely add to my collection and easily bring it to game day to enjoy with friends. Fantasy Tavern Brawl will be launching on Kickstarter in 2024, so please check it out. I hope you have enjoyed taking a look at Fantasy Tavern Brawl with me. I've put some links in the YouTube description. You can also follow Amuri Studios campaign and social media if you're interested in more of their creations. It's great to see more indie designers bring their games internationally. If you would like something new and fun to play, why not try some of these games from Japan? Thank you so much for your wonderful support as always. Please like, share or comment in my channel if you like the content. Thank you for watching. Until next time, happy gaming.